Welcome back. Well, some sad news tonight. It is our last educator of the week for this school year as state testing ramps up. We don't want to get in there and interrupt any of that. But you can still send in your nominations, and we'll be back in the classroom next fall to feature your favorite teachers. Here is Elena White's inspiring story in her own words. When I came for the job, I was coming as a paraprofessional, but one of the teachers, um, she ended up leaving. And when I went to my interview, I had told Ms. Hedry that I wanted to be a teacher because I love children. I've always worked with them. And when the teacher left, she remembered that. And that's how my journey in teaching been going. I'm in the MAT program to get certified. And I love it. I love it. I absolutely love it. Find you a good support team. Find other teachers that you trust that are willing to help and give uh, you their knowledge because the veterans here have been awesome to me. They have shared everything, resources, their knowledge, um, the trainings. Take advantage of every training that you can. It's been a help. I've always worked with at-risk youth um, through my organization, so I wanted a bigger platform, and I was like, well, let me go in the school district. I know I have some teacher friends, and um, talking to them, they was like, yeah, you'd be a good candidate, and that's the rest is history. I'm here. It is such a joy to be an impact in a child's life because we're at Barton, so they're at the age where they're getting to know each other, and you can be such an impact with them, helping know who they are. You know, set, go ahead and setting their goals. It is a complete joy. I would just say, if you're thinking about teaching, you know we have a shortage. Come on, I promise, it is such a joy and it is a wonderful experience getting to know these kids and helping them go out and meet their goals.